I'm not gonna beat a dead horse on this dude, but you guys already freaking know how I feel about this man. He's dead! Regardless, I'm glad we got a nice little photo of homeboy. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm sorry. All right, so to get this out of the way, I don't want to make a long intro, but a new gameplay of Radio 4 Remake has been released, guys. I saw it immediately, okay? I was at work, so I couldn't make this video until I got off. So we're going to go ahead and kick right into it. And if you guys need proof that I'm a Resident Evil fan, if you guys are new to the channel, look behind me. All right, that's all you get to see. All right, next, let's do this. <laughs> All right, so this video is from Game Informer. Now, I've actually edited the video to a point where we only see the gameplay and also some of the screenshots. So I'm actually gonna leave a link to the video so you guys, actually, guys can actually see it. And I'm also not gonna monetize this video out of respect for Game Informer for putting this out there for us. So thank you very much for that. So now, we're gonna go ahead and kick it off. So the first thing, of course, we see here is the church. Okay, this is the church right here, okay? Okay, so we're gonna do like a little breakdown. Like I've, I've seen it a little bit, but we're gonna go ahead and kick right into it. And you guys know my breakdowns and everything. It's gonna be me talking while it's gonna be playing. Probably a lot of pausing. All right, so as right here, so we see the cast, not the cast, Castle, the church right here, okay? Everything's off the top of the dome, guys. So I'm probably gonna stutter a little bit. From what I can see on these doors, so you guys know how in the church, right, you have you have the key that uh, that key that you put right in the center of the door, of course. So from looking right here, I see that that's like a little bit of difference right here. So we don't see like an opening to the for the door or anything like that. That's kind of that's kind of odd. I'm not gonna say odd, but it's different. It's a remake. I get it. But as you guys can see right here, we have the insignia. Okay, now there's nothing here that confirming that you have to do a puzzle to make this thing appear or, or you know, just like in the original. So nothing appears there, but it's, it's different. Okay, it's like it's like right there in your face. Okay, so definitely bigger than of course in the original, right? Now the villagers this time are actually in the castle. When we So if you actually play the original, right? You go into the church, the Los Illuminados are in there when Sadler's uh, coming to get, when Sadler appears and everything. When you come back in the castle after you actually jump out the window with Ash and everything, there's two Los Illuminados in the castle waiting there for you. So right here we have villagers inside the castle this time. Now the only time we see villagers, I keep saying castle, my apologies guys. So so the villagers, the only time we see them like in the church is when we play Ada in separate ways. There's actually villagers in the church, of course, and of course we have to do this little puzzle backwards and then you guys already know it rings the bell, etc, etc. So that's the only time we see the villagers in the church. So that's actually like nice little key difference in there. So it seems like the Los Illuminados is probably not going to appear until the castle. Okay, I'm actually down with that. All right, let's go ahead and continue on with the gameplay. Okay, so right now we see the homegirl Ashley. Okay, now from just looking at here, she she comes across and her AI comes right back across, and then it looks like she's looking at something. Cause I like I said, I seen a bit of the video. So she she comes back, she comes back across, and then she looks at something. Now see here under here, I was like, I'm, of course I have my media player on here, but you guys can see what I'm looking at. Like right here, I hope you guys can see that. It's this right here. So it looks like she's about to get carried off. It says help and everything. So she's looking like, from what she's looking at, she's looking at a villager and she's about to be picked up. So it seems that she's not even picked up right now. So it seems like she, this happens a little bit before she gets picked up. Okay, maybe it gives you like a heads up or maybe Ashley's like letting you know like, hey, help, someone, one's coming. I, I guess, I don't know yet. I'm just speculating here, guys. All right, so of course, Leon's busy kicking, kicking some booty crack right now. All right, so we go ahead and go. Now, of course, we see this insignia right here. So now we know Ashley is, Ashley needs help, okay? She's getting carried right now. And of course we see help here, we got that right there. So of course, in the original we saw her, like her health bar, and that's another thing I wanna, I wanna ask too. When we see here, we, I don't know if this is her health bar below right here, or anything like that. Guys, I'm sorry, I, like I said, I downloaded this, and I edit the video till we only see the gameplay. So I'm gonna hit play. So as we can see right here under here, we see Leon and Ashley right there, that's the insignia, so it seems like that's where everything is all Gucci and hunky-dory. But then when I press play, hopefully I can, uh, It'll, okay, so yeah, as soon as she gets carried, it seems like this pops up right here, like her health kind of thing. So I don't know if like that's her health, maybe it depletes as she's getting carried away, or that's how much time you have, I don't know, or anything like that. But it seems like that's her health right here, and her health doesn't show up, like up here or anything like that. Okay, so we got that, we got that in the mix there too. A little bit of speculation here, we got the sniper rifle here on Leon's back, okay? So it seems that we get the original, the first sniper rifle, of course, uh, like, at least I personally skipped that one. I was like, I don't need it, you know, because I'm a bad A like that. But anyway, but, uh, <laughs> so yeah, we're going to keep going, okay? Ashley gets picked up, we see the help sign, she gets picked up. Of course, we see this right here, and of course, we used to have her health right here, and it has like that explanation point flashing. And Leon right here does like an insta-kill right here on one of the villagers. Bam, okay. And then it skips to like this, you know, this cutscene right here. All right, guys, just a heads up, if I start to sniffle or anything like that, allergy season is coming back, so I'm gonna do my best here. Okay, so now the next part right here, we actually see Louis, Sarah, and Leon. We actually see this little bit of part here in like one of the cutscenes and when they were doing the reveal and everything like that, right? So next, we see a little bit more of this cutscene. Obviously, of course, Leon is like interrogating him. But now we see Louis, Sarah, Leon, 
and then we see the homegirl Ashley here. So now we can only speculate here that there's only one time you see these three in the same area when it's like a cabin area. So it seems like there's that little whole shootout little area of that cabin is still gonna be in the game. Like I said, they didn't cut it. They said they're not gonna cut it content, just add content. So it seems like that's still here, which is cool. So of course we got this little scene, this, this nice little cutscene here, which is, which is freaking, which is so freaking cool. Ashley looks really good. Now this part right here, now this is cool because now you actually get to see Ashley get carried away in this. We're leaving the we're leaving the church and we're coming down to the cemetery here. You see the villagers and everything. Ashley's, Ashley's getting carried away. And one thing I noticed here in this image here, it seems like it looked like oh no, it seems like her health yeah, it seems like her health went down just a little bit more. Okay, just a little bit more right here. All right, so now we're gonna continue on. Of course, one of the, so <clears throat> so the villagers throw can throw axes. Leon dodges, so that I'm only going to assume that you can actually shoot the axes. Of course, I do love doing that. So Leon dodges and keeps going. So he goes. So in this time, what I do like about this one, which really, really helps to extend to not kill Ashley, because I'm pretty sure a lot of us have done it before. When Ashley's getting carried away, we accidentally shoot Ashley sometimes. Here, Leon's coming up behind him, and of course, the villagers walking away instead of like, yo, let's go. We got the president's daughter. I don't know. So he's walking away again. And you got R2 for the for the knife. He comes back from the back. At least stabs him. It probably won't kill him, but it'll at least get Ashley. It'll save Ashley. You know what I'm saying? So we got that. But he he goes down a little bit. And another thing I want to point out here. Right there. Right there. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Got it right there. So when the enemies go down, so it seems like it did kill him. You can pick up the weapons. Not the weapons. The money right here. The the pesetas or PTS. You pesetas. I'm gonna I'm call him that. If I'm saying it wrong. I'm sorry, guys. So so we got to pick that up. So 200. So you can pick up the treasure just like that. So that's actually pretty cool. So treasures do fall. So that's a little more detail right there. And right here, see, it shows that Leon has a shotgun. So there's one. There's another thing I wanted to actually point out as well. So you have this weapon system right here. Now this weapon system on how this looks. What weapon system does this look like? Like this little configuration here on what this looks like. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna just let y'all answer. So it seems that they brought this, it seems like they have this right here, which is really cool. I do like this system right here. So it seems that whatever weapons you have, so it seems like maybe the right right here is like your incendiary, your grenades. These, of course, is more your weapons, all these. Maybe, of, of course, maybe you can, of course, set this up. You know, maybe it doesn't have to be set up in the attache case, but it's good detail to know so you can at least know which weapons you can pick. So there's a quick select to your weapon. So it's not like you gotta hit the attache case and pick the weapon. So that's good, that's good stuff to know. So you can quick swap, you can quick swap. And it's pretty cool that you can quick swap because you can see like which weapon Leon has on his back which one th and it's a good detail that I noticed even on Resident Evil 5 because they had that if you have more than enough weapons one weapon will be behind will be behind Chris and Sheva of course and if you switch it then it'll just go back in there of course unless you have a pistol or anything like that it won't show but you guys get the picture so that's good little detail that we have there so you can actually see a weapon on Leon's back so that's actually pretty cool because he carries plenty of weapons all right so let's continue on so now basically we got the gameplay out the way of course so it seems like a lot of villagers are are in this little area just like in the original so they're not pulling any punches another thing i wanted to uh, actually detail on the gameplay i'm gonna let it play throughout here for a second look at the rain now i was seeing a lot of comments that the rain just doesn't look doesn't look it i don't to me to be completely honest, and i'm not being biased because i'm a resident evil 4 fan and i love resident evil 4 i'm not being biased i think the rain is fine to be completely honest with you uh i mean it looks it's a remake it looks clean of course you see leon and ash like really wet in the rain like it it, it looks fine it, to, to my in, in my personal opinion i'm not shouting i'm not dogging anybody's opinion here we don't do that here on the griffin on the griffin channel nothing like that we, we love everyone's opinions here i just personally don't see what's bad about it personally um if you do see something bad about it like let me know in the comments guys you already know i'm fair here i try to respond to a lot of comments here so if the rain is really a bother to you guys I, I I don't know what I don't know what to tell you. I think it's just something, but at the same time, like it's something minimal. You know, they're not saying that oh, I'm not gonna get this game because of the rain. No, it's just something minimal. You know, just a little tweaking things here and there. And I I totally understand that. I personally just don't see anything wrong with the uh, with the rain personally. Um, but having I mean, heck, this is just one segment that we see for a little bit. So who knows if it's gonna last that long throughout? Okay, so now the next part here that I'm gonna show uh, this part of the video actually comes from. Evil Blitz, okay. I, was, uh, uh, I call him. A, I, I say a homie of mine, even though the homeboy doesn't know me. But he's a great. Uh, he's a great content creator with a lot of Resident Evil news and everything. So this part here, I got from him in the video, okay. So he shows like some of the screenshots and everything like that. And if you guys don't, I'm gonna leave the link in the description for his video as well, out of, out of respect. Like I said, I'm not monetizing this video because I didn't make any of these videos or anything like that, okay. So I'm gonna show him some respect here. I'm not gonna monetize this video for that. So we got Ashley right here. Like I said, Ashley looks good, okay. Ashley looks. Dang good, okay. I think they, uh, uh, she has big ears. They probably covered it with this hair here. I don't know, but at the same token, like she looks good. Ella Freya, I mean, the real life, you know, character model for her, she looks good too. So she looks good. I, I don't know how much I can, how much more I can say that. But 
looks great here. All right, we'll continue on going. I see also with Ashley, she doesn't have that, you know, that sweater anymore. It seems like right now she has like, like, like a scarf or like some type of, I'm not gonna say like a bandana or anything like that, but it's a good little detail that's, you know, that's different. All right, so it seems right here, she has that orange tank top, like right, right you know right underneath that you know the, her jacket because in the original she doesn't have a jacket of course so that that accounts that they kept it orange and everything from what i know she still has her her green uh, her green skirt that she still has now this right here tripped me out right here so in this this is actually one of my favorite screenshots so you know of course we see the homie leon right here we see Louis sarah in the picture and we see this this hunk of machine right here i don't know what the funk that is i never seen that in the original this is a new this is a new blood right here like i said they're not cutting content just adding content guys so this is a new enemy right here he has a big behind mallet okay i don't know who this dude is okay according to this weapon it looks like he can do some massive damage i was like but it seems like this is probably taking place in that cabin fight of course at least i can assume you know because we see lewis sarah here. that's like the only time you actually shoot with lewis sarah so unless they added some new stuff i was like but of course you got a new enemy here look he looks straight menacing i think the next screenshot actually is a, another close-up of this dude yeah okay that's homeboy right there so this is this is insane so it looks like you know it's an actual human being but he just has like a mask on of, a, of an animal or something like that of course you know like straight it, was, it just looks like some some deadly so, like someone deadly here not not out of salvatore or anything like that but a new enemy that's the thing a new enemy that's that's something that we have to look forward to. I do like that they did release this to show this. I'm I'm immensely happy about that because, like I said, they're adding content. So of course we as fans can be like, okay, so then maybe they're adding new enemies. Okay, so that's a good little talking point there. So let's continue on. So we got homeboy there. I wonder what his name will be too. All right, next image. Of course, now this is just another just a little little speaker right here. I can't really say much about this right here. It, was like, it could be just them in another cabin. It could be in the cabin where you know you fight. You know, you fight with Louis Sarah or anything like that. But one detail, like I said, Ashley still still has her skirt. Okay, a little, it was like just a little image right here. So at this point, obviously, of course, we have the president's daughter now with us. Now it seems like whatever this part could be. I don't know, but it's, it's a good little screenshot. At least now we see you know Ashley with us and everything. So that's that's a good little screenshot there. So now the same part right here, like I just mentioned right here, we have the weapon system right here, the quick slot, of course. So it seems like Leon has a good chunk of arsenal of weapons just like in the original it seems like right here you got the red nine you got the shoddy you got the original sniper rifle you got his silver ghost which is his pistol and it seems like you got the tmp right here and if i got this you got the frag grenade and this, this is probably maybe a flash uh, a flashbang right there so a flash grenade so that's what it looks like right there you got the health bar you know just looking like so it doesn't look like anything that we've seen yet to where you can increase this or anything i have was i know that yellow herbs are in this game so i'm going to assume this little extra space here is you know, i can get more health and we can see right here that ashley is with us according to this little insignia right here okay and of course you got the knife and then you got the durability right here so from what it looks like here it seems like the knife is i don't know if the knife is going to be like a weapon you can like just you know just use you know just a slice or if it's just if it's just purely just there for defense mechanism okay it was like because i don't see it you do see it in the attache case you do see it i, I do remember that uh, but you don't see it here like in the quick slide or anything like that so it seems like this weapon is mainly just for pure defense um, it could be that's my specula that's my opinion on well not opinion but that's my speculation okay well prediction now this image right here okay now this is too bad hey, look how menacing this dog is i do like this it looks like this is actually in okay yeah this is the village right here so this is the barn this is the main village the village square so this is the barn right here there's a little trail right here that you can go like to around here to go to the back of the house i think they kept that you got the right here you know you got the ladder that goes up there into the roof you got the main cabin that's right here on the right over there and of course you jump off the roof etc etc right and then you have right here the little uh the little um what's this thing called it has water in it guys you guys know what i'm talking about but you, you see the village is going to here and they pour water into here but you guys know what i'm talking about I was like, so yeah so of course this is where we see right here of course in the gameplay you see leon come out come off this roof he jumps off he does like a little roll and he's like right around here something like that so we're in, actually in the main village now in the original we didn't see these dogs in the main village we see them of course uh near the church and then we see them of course in the maze in the castle you know so on and so forth so it's actually it's actually cool now if you do see them in the village square i never saw them but that's actually cool and they look menacing like look at the teeth on this thing like that's freaking insane i do like it it seems like so from what this image looks like it seems that they do probably will growl before they charge at you just like they did in the original and before they start running so i don't know but that's this is a nice little image right here i freaking love this like like it's, it's not necessarily a new enemy but look Look at that dog remade, guys. Okay, look at that dog remade. Speaking of dog, I still believe that the dog is still in this remake. I still haven't seen anything that he is dead yet. 
All right, I'm not gonna go beat a dead horse on that. Next, now this is actually a good image right here. So I got some comments saying, am I gonna do like a video on the, like the breakdown of the map? Guys, like I said before, I'll repeat it. The reason why I never did it is because I couldn't get a clear image of the map. Every time I look for an image of it, it would be blurry AF. Kind of like how this video is a little bit because of course it's not my original video. So it looks a little blurry to you guys a little bit, you know, and I, my sincerest apologies, but hope the video still works out for you guys. But still, we got the map here. It says head for the extraction point. So I'm going to assume this is after you save Ashley, or is this the tower right here? Maybe I'm losing it i don't know this is the oh i am being stupid my bad guys okay yep village square i think this is where yeah the yep okay you got the typewriter right here you got this trail right here okay 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 so leon's right here according to this triangle here i'm trying to think because you got the trail right here you go okay that's the okay there we go. okay i'm an idiot guys so this is the this is the trail right here because it says farm you got the farm area and then you go like that long behind trail right when you go to that trail by the farm the, it stops at the house right here and that's where you find Lewis Sarah, if I got everything right. So what is this trail right here? Because this goes straight to the lake, right? But then right here, this is Village Square. And I'm assuming this is where the tower is, right? And then you come here, it says Town, yep, town Hall. You got the, the typewriter right here. So that still stays the same. You go underground, you go all the way around the trail. Okay, it's the merchants right here. And I'm going to assume, yeah, okay, so the church is right here. So, okay, so, okay, so my original thought process was wrong. I'm sorry, guys. So this, so yeah, I was right. I'm, I'm right now. So this is the church right here. And then, of course, you go through this little hair. You got the quarry and everything, and you got the lake and everything right there. So what's different here is that after you go on this trail, you got the house area for Louis Sarah if, if he does go there. But then, okay, wait a minute, guys. I'm an idiot again. I'm being an idiot. So, gosh. All right, so the farm right here, you go down this trail, and then it says head for the extraction point. So the extraction, this is the, this is right here. Okay, this is obvious. Okay, now I get it now. You just picked up Ashley because you got, got just got from the church. You go into the square, you go into the village square, you go in this trail, you got the farm area, but then you, of course, use Ashley to, you know, piggyback up the dang door, and then bam, you go on the long, across the bridge, and then this is the cabin, of course, where you meet Louis Sarah. So that's probably still the same. But this trip, now this is different. This is different. Past this, you got, you're supposed to have two separate ways okay not hinting ada ada wong story two separate ways you got the you got the bella sisters on the left and you got the el gigante on the right but after you keep going and everything like you get you got you know you got chief mendez and everything you got that you got the whole area to the you know to his barn all that stuff that we fight chief mendez and everything but when you go here it says lake so i'm kind of so some things have changed just looking on this map. Now, if I'm wrong, guys, please correct me. Like I played this game so many freaking times. If I'm missing something, please correct me. It seems like right here, this is where the castle's at. I'm pretty sure like this whole map is probably just not filled out, but this is where the castle's at. But um, right, it was like, but I never known another trail going to the going to the lake, other than maybe this right here. I do know you go. I do know that when you go on the lake, you go across the lake, and there's a whole another little area. But it didn't have this right here. But I hope you guys get where I'm going with this. I'm trying to figure it out just by looking at this map. But I could be wrong. But it's definitely cool. It's definitely cool, really cool to like break down this map and look at it. Because it seems like everything looks the same. But it seems like there's like a hint of differences. Just a bit of differences here. So it's definitely good to look at. But uh, but yeah, okay. So next screenshot there. This screenshot, really not much, not much explanation. Leon, I'm straight, guys. Good looking dude. That's all I got to say. Of course, his hair is still freaking pristine. Okay, that's all, I gotta, that's all I can say about that. His area looks pristine. But this area looks like he's probably in the castle. The background has those kind of windows and everything. I think they're probably in some point of the castle. That's all I can That's all I can assume. And you got, so we got typewriters, of course. So this is the area of the merchant, because you see the merchant's hand right here. All right, so we're in the area with the merchant. And you got skulls right here. So I'm going to assume it could be some part of the some part in the village. Some part of the village. Actually still looks good. I'm not going to pause it. Actually still looks good. That's all I can say. Look at her lips. Mm. But, but, <laughs> but anyway, all right. Now this, of course, we got this part right here. Now this is definitely a good part on like what it could be. I wouldn't be surprised if this is part of the castle. Okay, I wouldn't be surprised if, if it could be a part of the castle. I'm not 100% sure, but but from what I can tell, Ashley is with us in this part because she's right she's right there. You can see this little icon here. So I'm still concerned because like, I think that little meter thing when she got picked up was her health, but you don't see her health in like any anything like this or anything like that. So that's actually good information. All right, let's continue on. I think because I think there's more screenshots. Oh, okay, that's another thing I want to point out. Do you see right here? I'm gonna have editor Griff make sure he scroll, make sure he zooms in. So right there, right below Leon's like right, right hip, you see the flashbang right there. So it seems like whatever grenades you carry, it actually shows. That's cool. Of course, it seems that we're here, we're here in the village. What this looks like here, this is probably them in the cabin where they're gonna actually battle it out with, uh, with Louis Sarah. Because I don't see anywhere where he's stuck in a cabin like this and he sees villagers coming at him, other than the very beginning. But he's not wearing his jacket right here. So I'm gonna assume this is probably a part in the game where maybe you go into the, maybe you go into the cabin. 
you lock everything up, he's looking out the window. Instead of like having his back towards the door, like that cutscene, he's probably looking out the window and seeing the villagers come up. And then we see that Louis Sarah is in, is in, the, is in the cabin. That could be a switch up in the cutscene that I could assume. It's a nice, it's a nice little picture too. And we got the homeboy, the merch. Okay, I don't want to get too excited, guys, but I'm sorry. But you guys, I'm not gonna beat a dead horse on this dude. But you guys already freaking know how I feel about this man. He's back! Regardless, I'm glad we got a nice little photo of homeboy. Look at you, look at you, G. Oh, look, that's all I can say is look at you. I missed you, man. I missed you. All right. Let's continue on, guys. I'm glad I'm, I'm glad they put a screenshot of homie. Now this is a very good this is a very good scene here too. Okay, so we got Leon. Of course, he's holding his flashbang. So I'm going to assume that just like in the original, the flashbang will knock these out instantly. Okay, of course. And what's what's crazy about this? What I'm liking is that I don't know if like Leon's like put his hand up and same thing with Ashley is like this because of these like just flinging around. And they're like trying to cover their face, or if they're trying to cover their face because of the rain. I don't know. I think Ashley's being a little bit dramatic. On this, if she's if she's only covering from the rain, like I never I never been rained on to point I'm like I'm like shoot, you know I never done that. I don't know, but Leon seems calm, cool, casual. Like that's nah, just a little water. That's fine. I'm still trying to see these motherfuckers. So I can throw this. That's what Leon looks like. Okay, I'm just making jokes here, guys. But 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 yeah, I, I do like they got the last part. It seems like it looks like they have a far reach too. Like because we know that they you know they ring up and then they swipe, but just from these little parts right here, it seems like yeah they they swing far. Or if this is just regular, I don't even want to know how far they can stretch. But uh, but yeah, I'm glad that they showed this part right here. Now I want to know if they're gonna have the different ones. That, you know, you got these right here. You got the ones in the castle that can that is a one hit or quitter. They bite your head off. And you got also got the ones that are in the village where like they they're, they're like they like shh, you know that little thing. You know those. I I can't stand those. But I don't know, I'd rather get the one hit or quitter ones because they're actually they're actually, I'm fine with that. You can actually get pretty close and you have time to move away. These guys you get close, you just get hit. But but that's cool though. From what this is looking like here, I can't really tell where this is taking place. Obviously, of course, the village. But I can't necessarily pinpoint where this could be because you got a trail right here. This could be the this could be the village square because this looks like the barn that's right here, and this looks like maybe the trail that Leon came through because it looks like it like curves like right here to where you can go to where you can go behind the barn. It does look like that. I could be wrong, but it just it just looks like the village square. And of course, you got this little puddle right here that looked like the puddle that we saw in this in this screenshot here. So it looks like this could be the area. Like Leon is right here; he's moving around. The camera angle just panned over, and then we see, then we see that. That's all. I, that's what I can assume where where we're at right here. But I think I'm right. And right here, this looks like, of course, the church. So some tells me that. This is at, this is maybe a cutscene after you save Ashley. Maybe he's looking over maybe the balcony and seeing the villagers come in. That's all I can assume at this particular part. The villagers coming in, you know, they're like trying to you know bang on the door. They finally break in. Maybe you don't see Sadler here, you know. Maybe you don't see Sadler in the church, at least uh, in that in that cutscene. You see the villagers like freaking trying to come in, and Leon's got to escape out of there. That's all I can assume. Okay, I can only assume that he got out through the window only because the a lot of these guys were in here. In the gameplay, when Leon, Leon and Ashley were right here. So if you go back here, I'm going, I'm going to assume like Leon is probably looking down to the balcony or something like that. The, the villagers break in, and now Leon's right here. He probably came out of the window and then came around, basically flanked him. That's all I can. That's all I can assume, of course. And of course, if it's like the original, then of course after you, he breaks through the glass in that window. New chapter, etc., etc. That's all I can assume there, right? But we're just speculating here, guys, we're trying to make some comparisons to the original. But that's what this looks like here. So the villagers are in the church here. Okay. This one was hard to decipher because when I first saw this image, it looked like. It looked like part of the castle because you got the concrete slabs and everything like that in here. It's hard to decipher what this is because you got this little wooden, these this little wooden roof right here. You got like these woods back here. When it comes to the castle, a lot of it was made of brick and concrete and everything. So it's kind of decide. It's kind of hard to decipher where this could be in the village, like like a, at least a good part of the village, meaning like a decently nice design part of the village. No offense to the villagers that live there, you know they're humble living. But then, but because of this, I'm going to assume this is part of the castle only because like the concrete and the brick slabs and everything. That's all I can assume. Okay. Or, no, I, I, literally, I literally just, I'm not going to lie, I literally just had an image that maybe this is Ashley looking out the window from the church and Leon's trying to go in there and save her. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. See, see, this, see this is exciting about the freaking remake because you can speculate what these images look like. You don't freaking know because we can do the comparison to the original as much as we freaking can. We just still do not know what the funk this part could be because I just Ashley just like Ashley's peeking. Right now, she's not like if if it was someone that she you that you trust, you're not gonna be peeking. You're gonna be like, yo, I'm right here. You know what I'm saying? It looks like Ashley just doesn't know who this man is yet, and she's just peeking. I, I don't know. And maybe you can he can see her through a window and like, hey, I'm coming up or something. Like, you, you know, I don't I don't know. I don't know. Like a what's that story called? You know the you know the princess in the tower or something like that. I don't know. You you guys know what I'm talking about. But this kind of, little comedy right there. That's probably what what this could be. I don't know. I mean, heck, you would think. Nah, never mind. This is Ashley talking. She's not gonna jump down. 
but uh who knows i don't know i don't know we can speculate through these screenshots as much as we can but I don't, that's the exciting part about this remake because they can like they said i'm gonna keep repeating it they're only adding content not taking away but we don't know what the heck changed here this screenshot could tell a lot you know i don't i don't know it's so freaking exciting guys all right it, like officially we have <laughs> it's january 31st right now <laughs> but this game's coming so freaking soon man i'm going to assume this part is is the church still i'm assuming this part of this is the church still only because this doesn't look, yeah, this doesn't look like anywhere in the castle. Look like outside, we got the leaves, we got the trees here and everything. Yeah, this looks like the village still. This looks like the church, probably. You just saved Ashley. Yeah, this, yeah. I'm going to assume that this is it. Maybe Leon finally got in the church and uh, he's probably explaining to Ashley what's going on. Ashley's still a little apprehensive. I don't know. This is what we're speculating here. Do you ever use, you ever try to picture what a, what a picture looks like? You know, when you're in elementary school or anything like that, you try to decipher? That's literally what I'm trying to do here. But, but we don't know anything based off these pictures or anything, but man. I tell you right now, Game Informer, thank you very much. Thank you very much for pointing these out there. Evil Blitz, Game Informer, I'm gonna link you guys' videos, show these guys some love. As I got these two parts from both of them, okay? So, at the same time, I hope the video quality and everything was good, but I hope the breakdown was good. You know, the speculations and these, well, I'm not gonna say rumors, but my opinions on the game, everything. Like, everything looks really freaking good with this new gameplay that they, that they finally showed. I do know that I think some stuff, more some stuff is gonna be next week and everything. Uh, I think I'm not 100% too sure, but we'll see. We'll see, guys. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. This. Make sure you guys dab up that like button, subscribe, and on the description. The description sign off. Find to be silent, humble, professional. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in my next video. Take care.